today, everyone, we will be representing our school SMK Academy for World Youth Innovation and Invention 2023 competition. My name is Tanashri, Nandini, Kavishri, and Kipika. <laughs> Uh, Uncle Lang, sebarkan rokok Saya nak hisap rokok Awak ada hisap rokok eh? Ha. Ada umur berapa awak? Uh, saya baru tujuh berat Oh, tak boleh lah Muda Sama hati tahu rokok Saya nak cubalkan Alah, rokok tak bagus Boleh juga Di bayar tu, nanti rugi barang sehat lagi Dengan hmm. hisap lah rokok tak bagus Betul hmm. Aku pun suam awak kasih buang Tak bagi tahu lagi Awak lagi tak hisap hmm. <laughs> In this video clip Our friend Nandini and Kitiga will approach adults smoking in public to ask for a cigarette to smoke. Invariably, each adult will refuse and explain to our friend why they should not smoke. From this video clip, we understand that smokers may be victim of their addiction, but they do not want their children or any youngsters to repeat their mistake. In fact, nearly 70% of smokers want to quit smoking, but are unable to do so as consequence of their dependence on nicotine which is one of the most addictive substance known to us. What causes cigarette addiction? Is it too good that people find it hard to quit smoking? For those who don't actually, the issue of smoking addiction is caused by the nicotine in cigarettes. Nicotine is the main ingredient in tobacco that causes addiction to the smoker. And even worse, the addiction produced by nicotine is as strong as the addiction to heroin. Apart from that, nicotine that enters the body will cause the blood vessels to narrow, block, and reduce the flow of blood and can cause a stroke. Nicotine also has adverse effects on the human brain. Most importantly, it causes addiction. Nicotine can make a person feel happy and calm because nicotine has characteristics like the hormone dopamine which plays a role in improving a person's mood. This effect will increase a person's desire to smoke and cause addiction. However, this feeling of happiness is only false because smokers do not realize the adverse effects that will occur on their brains due to this addiction especially for underage teenagers. Among them, brain development is disrupted, so it is difficult to concentrate on studies and also to control impulses. That is why our product is here to benefit those users. Our product can help to reduce withdrawal symptoms and reduce nicotine cravings which people can face after using our product as a substitution for normal cigarettes. Moreover, our product can assist the user to cut down the number of cigarettes they smoke each day gradually or completely. Now, let's move on to the procedure on making the product. The materials we used in the process of making our herbal strip are herbs such as mulberry leaves, marigold, jasmine, tea leaves, neem, and stevia. We are also using cotton as our filter and chewing gum wrapper as our rolling paper. First, we have to pick out fresh herbs and dry them under direct sunlight for at least a few couple of days. Now we have to use our pestle and mortar to grind these herbs into coarse powder. Now we have a very fine and coarse powder. Now it's ready to be added into our rolling paper. Now I'm going to add our filter. Now it's ready to be rolled together.
now we have our finished product our product is very cost effective our product only needs low cost material that can be easily found in each household the cost of our product is rm50 so the retail price will be rm1 ringgit 50 cent this is our financial plan to sum up we think that our product is overall successful Thus, we don't claim that our product is flawless, since some things can be slightly improved. For instance, herbal cigarettes still produce carbon monoxide, gas, and tar when smoked. But, since we do not add nicotine and tobacco, we believe that our product is not addictive and these effects are just for a shorter period of time, compared to regular cigarettes. Since our main goal is to help people quit smoking gradually or completely.